Okay, so there's a there's a um a rank after every battle tells you how you do. I got plus one in strength, plus one in speed. You, know, you should always do like that. One in defense, resistance, and charm. Okay, yeah, that's not too bad. Level up and stats increase. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Hit point, HP, strength, magic, the thirty effect, attack power with critical rush as well as critical hit rate. Okay. Speed, luck after recovery items. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, defense against physical resistance, charm. Effect is drain rate of battalion's endurance. Okay. So there is battalion in this game, I just don't know what it is. I won't let myself stop here. The unit who performed the best in battle will be selected the MVP. The MVP unit will gain additional experience. What? That seems broken. That's definitely not the, what the MVP does in the main game. Like, if you choose to let someone be the MVP, so all I have to do is, I don't know how many characters you can take into a battle at once, so all you have to do is just stick, stay on that character no matter the enemy, have them, like, kill everything, and uh, they, be the, they can gain the most experience, and then they can gain additional experience by being the MVP. That seems, uh, if you want to grind up a character, like, that seems broken. Leveling up combat or natural combat or natural will up after they've been uh, used a set number of times. This will make them stronger and reduce weapon durability loss when they are used. Okay. Grounder and the wrath strike. Any unit practice in battle will receive class experience post battle. If this raises their class level, it might require new combat magic abilities and their weapon level may increase. When the unit's weapon level increase, they will be able to equip more powerful weapons, they will be able to attack more times consistently. What? Does that mean like he can, I can get more combos? That must be more com that must mean more combos. I don't know what else could that, that could mean. Vite Veronia... Okay, I got a whole bunch of stuff. After battle, we'll be able to check the weapon had resources probably required in battle, which are the Duke's enormous, so automatically start boosting item, get boost selected unit in. You cannot use stat boosting item by select, uh, you can use the stat boosting in the storehouse from the pause menu. Is that like, hold on. A rare permanently increases resistance by two, okay. Alright. Okay, current gold. A thousand. Hang on. You're seriously the Imperial Princess, the Crown Prince, and the heir to the Alliance? Yes. And as the three of us are now in your debt, I think formal introductions are in order. My name is Edelgard von Hressfeld, Princess of the Adrestian Empire. I am Dimitri Alexander Blathen, Crown Prince of the Holy Kingdom of Forest. And I'm Claude Von Rieke, grandson of the leader of the Leicester Alliance. Things looked grim there for a moment. Thanks to you, we put those bandits to flight. Bit of a miracle we ran into you out there, but hey, I'll take it. Uh, both lobby of a heroic deed, play cool. Uh, claim was team effort. Sounds correct, at least. 
Gerald's too smart to get smoked out by a bunch of rumors, but they're all I've got at the moment. In any case, we won't find our own two feet in all this dark. We should return to camp and get our bearings before... Hello there, house leaders! Hello, brave mercenary! We've mopped up what's left of those rascals, so what say we return to camp? And I insist you accompany us, code mercenary. Who? Me? You heard the men. We'll wait out the night together and make for the village in the morning. It's a great plan, especially if you want to get paid, as we're a tiny bit short on pocket change at the moment. Yes, and those mercenaries you were looking for? Gerald's band, was it? They may be in Ramada Village tonight. There's no telling when they'll move on. If you come back to our camp, we have maps that may help you get one step ahead of them. This is clearly the wisest course of action. Not to mention that I would enjoy conversing with you further. But of course, the choice is yours. Uh, go watch them, I guess. Why can't things ever be simple? Those are really short. But, um, if I may, did I hear you mention a Gerald earlier? Yes, do you know him? He heads up a pretty elite band of mercenaries, so I imagine his name is spread all over Fulton by now. Mercenaries, is it? No. No, it can't be him. Can it? Well, I'll just have to meet this Gerald myself. After I've seen my duties through, of course. After all, if I don't finish my assigned tasks, I'm mission the point. I will kill you. <laughs> Get it? Missing? Mission? Come now, this is good stuff! <laughs> That's our Alois. Come on, let's get moving before he really gets going. Class experience, class levels. Okay, so I, I think you do need to meet certain criteria before you can do switch class. Oh, it's Helda! Ignaz, Raphael! Battle prep. After battle, you'll be able to interact with your allies back in the camp. Press A when near unit to talk to them. Okay. Oh man, there's a lot of people here, huh? Welcome to our humble uh, base camp. I assume you're familiar with the uh, officer's academy, the ground uh, girl Mark monastery. Yes, the three young people you assisted earlier are at the head of the economy's uh, three houses. You find other students, teachers, and even members of the uh, Knights of Saros here at this camp. Uh, I fear you caught us in the middle of uh, any outdoor activities, carrying out the beginning of the academy school year. But the situation becomes quite a mess when the band of uh, brigands attacked us. I wish you could chat uh, links. Seeing the three classes had uh, wish to speak with you. Also, I cannot keep you to myself. This is a great opportunity for you to bond with your resources. Okay. Okay, so th there's not a... Hold on. Unit information sheds. Uh, okay. Support. Okay, so that's that's how you do support. Storehouse. Bonus. Okay, so I don't. I don't need the bonus. Bonus is a amiibo. Okay. Let me create the save file right here. So it doesn't have save points. What a pain! It doesn't have. Doesn't have voice acting all the time, which is disappointing. How the kind of outdoor activity? Call the time. 
and we're seeing anything like this happen. Plus, we got the high, uh, three high-ranking noble children here. Uh, the guard was more than double the usual year. The thing that were killed by some hack based uh, brigands, a real mess. Make no mistake. Now I have to find a way to swing on this Lady Rhea, huh? Alright. Hey, Felix, are you still a, a jerk? Oh, it's you. You're a new merc, right? Sheds? The boar says you have some uh, skill. You have to give me a demonstration before we head out. Agree, you still Jessica, you refuse his offer, ask who the boar is. We know who the boar is. Deal, I can learn some uh, sometime before sunrise. Look for looking forward to it. Alright, support uh, points. Support points only strengthens the bond between two units. Units gain support points by giving appreciated answers, performing activity that makes the other happy. And there's a battle together. Alright. Hold on, did I, did I earn like a support point by doing that? Alright, no I did not, but I did earn some support points. Hey, uh. Oh, you're the mercenary, I got a great to meet you, I'm Annette, this is my best friend Mercedes. Hello, nice to make your acquaintance, have you already spoken with the others? Uh, say so you haven't. Not yet, but I'm planning to. That's what I mean to know much about the others. Yes. Just to start the first with Matt Academy, so my grasp with others, Blue Lions, the tenures are best. Okay, so you basically Shaz took the place of Balith in this short timeline. You says his highness and my gratitude. Uh, I'll see this debt be repaid. Uh, shrug it off. Crack a joke? Yeah. In that case, you can pay me back around the sparring. Let's see what you're made of. As you wish. To be honest, uh, I'd like to treat you to a meal, but we lack the time. Alright, I'd like to do. Can't wait to uh, talk to more about him. I mean, beginning the first conversation, gratitude to you, Shed. We're owing more debt. Also, I examined the map earlier in the village where you're handed it. Uh, seems a bit low more to the east. So, uh, thank you for the advice. I appreciate it. I checked the map earlier, but couldn't tell where the woods I actually was. Well, I'm glad I, I could be service. I hope you're able to reach your destination at this time. You'll be uh, staying until sunrise, yes. I hope you take the opportunity to convince the other, uh, converse with the others here. Of course, not, like the idea of you suddenly you like yourself. Hold on. Of course, now that I'm spoiling the idea onto you so suddenly, you likely find yourself a loss of who you want to be speaking to. On that note, I'm more happy to give you introduction to the Blue Line House students. Did you hail from the land of dust? Perhaps you've heard it. He tends to keep to himself. He possesses one of the kindest hearts of anyone I know. I'm proud to call him my vassal. Speak to him. You'll see why. Alright. To do hands he tends to keep to. Hold on. Alright. Your interest flatters me. But I'm afraid I find myself unsure of where to begin. Perhaps I'll have thought of a topic when next we speak. But If I can see their abilities in this game, that'd be great. 
but I can't right now. I guess you can only read them when you join their their class. You forgot she lo also loves food. Thanks. Hello, friend. You're the one who helped Dimitri, right? Well, we're all you for that. If uh, you need a meal, it's on me. I'm grateful as well. I offer my thanks to the meal too, but I heard you leave uh, shortly. Oh, I don't believe you. Uh, no, I got your name. Uh, give your name. I'm Michelle. Keep it in mind in case you ever need a heavy hitter. <laughs> I'll do just that. And uh, while well, it's unfortunate. We're parting ways here. I suspect you might have a chance to meet again in the future. Good. A shame we don't have the time to get to know each other a little better, though. Alright. It's Ash! Hey there. Hey there. There, you must be the mercenary. I'm hearing about an Ash and the student Gary Max of Officer's Academy. Do you know about the Academy? There's three houses, each based on where the person is from. How have you heard of it? Oh, I heard of it, alright. One of my employees a little ways back couldn't shut up on how he's uh, gone to the place. I can see that lots of influential nobles and royals from all, uh, all over study at the academy. I actually find it pretty daunting always to be surrounded by rich and powerful. It's a lot easier to hunt someone like you. Hey, Hanneman. Hanneman Professor Officer in my academy. I heard of Taylor recent exploit. I should express my thanks. Uh, and then on the other matter, do you possess a crest? Ask him what the crest is. Claim that he's barking up the wrong tree. Let's see. I know uh, practically nothing about crests, but I'm still pr uh, pretty sure I, I know if I had one. Truly, I've never in in investigated the subject. People are not always willing to power their own crest, you know? Uh, that's why now crests are powerful, they're out of the blood, they're passed down through the generations, and the children, these are crests made of super power, perhaps have ability with a power for weapons, so as a hero's relic. If you were to come to resent the mountainous area, I could take the time to conduct a full investigation if you like. I heard so many people, t um, I hear so many people today, I never want to look at the bandage again. Oh, and who do you have here? No way, don't say it, let me guess. You are the brave, uh, Valgarbond knight who appeared to boldly protect the, the, me from those, uh, uh, brigands earlier. Uh, Cracker. Not exactly, my name is Shaz, I'm a mercenary. Oh, I see, not a kiss, I'm Manwala, a woman from the Ninety Faces, teacher Dr. Sanctress. Though I have worked myself very bone, uh, very bone today, so right now I'm merely a sad and lonely woman, lonesome woman. Sure, because I definitely wanted to know that. What did you mean? Can't believe they talked me into going to the on the trip. It'd be fun, he said. Nothing ever happens, and, and damn, there's just something dangerous everywhere. I thought I was going to die out there. I was uh, swinging my spear, and then everything got a uh, wishing ring. Some girls from Elster Company showed up and led me to safety. I tell you, kids, these ladies are great, uh, graceful and strong, nothing like the useless punk from my days. Listen. Listen. Hello, I'm called Petra, and find you to be quite uh, fascinating. Uh, give her give your name. Sure. Okay, two stars. Okay, two ups. Uh, I'm such a technical mercenary, though I guess right now I'm kind of just a drifter. I do not have an understanding where you're drifting to. Yeah, through the world, you know, the sort of kicking around with no real end to go. Sure. Okay, so you do, you can run with B. Nice. Ah, there you are. Thank you for assisting the previous battle. 
I'd like to discuss with you, uh, discuss your future if you have a moment. If you find yourself with no place to go after we accomplish our objective, hope you might hire you on for uh, the Empire. I can promise you will be handsomely paid. Uh, could be uh, including the work you did today. So what do you say? Uh, the side later ask why she wants to hire you. I'm not usually hired into services by people quite so high up in the food chain. I was like special attention. I value your talent. Now that I have the ability to see the first hand. I don't buy. Have you spoken to the others here in the camp? If you like, I'll tell you a little bit about the students in my own houses, the Black Eagles. Well, you're certainly not tepid. You do realize you're addressing the heir to the Imperial throne, yes? Still, I suppose I admire that sort of freedom. It must be nice not to have your lot in life decided for you. Hubert of House Vestra is my attendant. His family is unusual in that they're noble, but lack territory of their own. Hubert is deeply loyal to me, and you can trust him completely. In fact, I imagine he's quite grateful for what you've already done. That's... that... is he a healer in this game? That's Dorothea Arnold. She's an up-and-coming songstress in a famous Imperial Opera Company. Or, she was, at least. For some reason, she abandoned her musical career and enrolled in the Officers' Academy. She has a very magnetic personality, which I'm sure you'll see. Have you spoken with Ferdinand? One conversation will explain him far better than I can. He's the heir to an name drop, which drives him to excel, but he can be quite the handful sometimes. His support is called name drop because he keeps saying his own name over and over again. I love it. One of our classmates usually stays holed up in the dormitory instead of coming on these assignments. Her name is Bernadette. If you bump into her, don't be surprised if she screams and runs away. That's sort of her thing. <laughs> Prefer class is thief. Okay. Surely you know someone like Linhart. He's as bright as they come, yet just as lazy as well. That's simply how he is, though. I can't force him to apply himself, but he'll come around, most likely. Alright, so that's the uh, Black Eagles. Okay. 